up here would be Mr. Kingston. Yeah. Um, would be the over shoulders here, seeing the uh, this computer screen, but and but not um, down there where there is no sonar, where there's supposed to be sonar. Found ourselves a liberty ship. Oh, yeah? Yes! All right, <laughs> good. At last. All right. What did we find? We found a shipwreck. All right. Well, you need to be in shot. No, no, no. I get called in. You got, you got the stick, Mike? I just brought a sling. Okay, you guys all set? I'll, uh, I'll coach you sticks. Okay. So there's some. Well, there's this. Oh, there's that. And guys, you know, try and keep it don't, like very low key, but yeah. excited enough that, that it makes sense. So, I have it. You have to be natural. You cannot fake acting. It's either in your blood or it's not. It, uh, it's in my blood. Remember that? All right, so where were you going? Stay here, Mark. Yeah, you're right there. Yeah, you're right there. Okay. Rolling. All right, this is uh, ROV in general. And ROV, uh, the tilt and the camera goes out. We're Call turning. for their father. Take one. We're turning, Mark. Oh, that's pushing that around. There it is, there it is. Now, yeah. some of it's just the stuff that's just rolling in front of the That current's just ripping along there. Okay, can you, can you work around? All right, I'll come around to the, to the right there. Is that it? That's it, we're getting close, okay. Can you hand just a little to the left? A little left, there it is, yeah. We're off the debris and something's wrong with the camera, I don't know, we're off the limit. No, the only reason that we're seeing any of this stuff is all this, like the, are these being flipped up? Well, I think the ship just swung and pulled us right off of it. Look at that structure. Right? Yeah. Now I see a line there. What is that? Yeah, it's going out. your tether. Bout your tether. But what is that just above? It's almost circular. Vince was able to fly around the site as if it were sitting in an open field. The wreck was a tangled mess of twisted steel with very little of the hull structure left intact. It would be extremely difficult to find evidence of what had put the ship on the bottom. If it had been a torpedo hit, how could they ever tell? As Vince flew the ROV over a massive broken deck, there was a huge pile of cargo. It was ammunition, what looked like thousands of rounds, a variety of big shells and bombs, each the size of a man's leg. And most of them appeared to be intact. It reminded me of a story that Roy had told me about their biggest fear when salvaging these war wrecks. There were vast amounts of explosives right through the ship. Bombs, shells, all with their detonators in them, ready-use ammunition of all sorts of types. We were very concerned about the explosives in the ship. We um, caused us what they call a sympathetic detonation. What we had done was accidentally detonating the munition, part of the munitions cargo on the wreck we probably caused a charge with 100 tons of explosives, and the result was quite dramatic. Maybe there had been a similar explosion here, while this wreck was being salvaged, and not all of the ammunition had exploded.